Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September 15th of 2023. Well, it is titled Venus, Moon and the Smoking Mountain. So what do we see here? Well, let's start here on Earth. And one of the things we see off to the right hand side is the wing of a plane. So this was taken from an airplane uh, flying near uh, the smoking mountain off in the distance. And as you may guess, this smoking mountain is a volcano in Mexico as this was a flight heading to Mexico City. Now, the volcano is not unique to Earth. And in fact, we have volcanic activity on lots of other objects in our solar system, including many similar volcanoes on Venus and Mars that are known. But there has also been evidence of certain kinds of volcanic activity on places like the moon and Mercury. And even in the outer solar system, where the volcanoes do not erupt rock, but ice because of the much colder temperatures out there. So volcanoes very common uh, in the solar system. And in fact, Earth is probably the second most volcanically active object after one of the moons of Jupiter, Io, which is incredibly active with many, many volcanoes. Now, up in the sky, we see a number of a couple of objects visible. And one of those, the top one is the planet Venus. Venus is the third brightest object in the sky after our sun and our moon. So it'll be the and it is the brightest star like object that looks like a point. Venus is now transitioned from the evening sky where it was earlier this year into the morning sky and is now prominently visible just before sunrise. So if you look off to the east right before sunrise, the bright object that you see there is the planet Venus. Now here, uh, joining Venus for this image taken on September the 12th, we see the moon and this is a thin crescent moon. And if you look at it carefully, you can see how just the lower portion is illuminated. It's actually a very thin crescent. Now the rest of the moon, which appears darker, is actually slightly illuminated by the Earth. So light from the Earth will actually reflect to the moon and back, making even the unilluminated portion of the moon glow very dull. Now it's not normally visible, but when there's just a thin crescent, you can often see this that we call the Earth shine, because it is not directly illuminated by the sun, but is illuminated by sunlight reflected off Earth to the moon and back. So here we get to see a number of different things, including Venus up to the uh, uh, upper in upper part of the image centered on our moon. There is a thin crescent and just down below the moon, the active volcano with the smoke billowing out of the caldera at the top. And of course, we also see the wing of the plane as it headed toward Mexico City. So that was our picture of the day for September 15th of 2023. It was titled Venus Moon and the Smoking Mountain. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be fire over ice. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.